Well, hello, all you glorious hunters out there. Welcome to Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. It's finally here, and we're going to start our playthrough. We're going to be doing live streams of this as well, so make sure to tune in for those. Let's go ahead and get started. I see. You have, an you have an appointment from the Hunter's Guild to work for the Wicademy. You must have traveled far. On behalf of Berna, let me welcome you, Hunter. I am chief of this humble village. Ours is a village rich with history, centered around the Wicademy, created long ago to research the origins of the mysterious ancient limestone structure at the base of the mountain near here. The Wicademy is now one of the world's preeminent institutions in all manner of monster research, and Berna, which was founded from a small settlement that cropped up around the Wicademy, has walked hand in hand through history with this most illustrious of institutions. Ah, forgive me. You have not come to me for history lessons. Go introduce yourself to the chief researcher, and he will register you for your appointment as a Wicademy hunter. All right, so let's go ahead and find him. Uh, we know our home is there, so we can actually change our hunter arts and stuff in there. Um, but I think today we're probably going to maybe start off with... Um, I don't know. Oh, how do we run? Oh, God. Controls are weird. There we go. So strange using a switch controller. You must be the new assistant from the guild has appointed... Uh, has dispatched for me. I can't read. You're not quite as bookish as I expected. That's all right, though. The Academy is more than just about books in its study of monsters. Sometimes our research requires that we go out into the thick of things and study monsters in their natural habitats. And that's where you'll come in, deputy researcher. You'll take care of the occupational hazards. Oh, boy. Also, please sign this liability waiver for lasting effects from fire, poison, paralysis, slime mold, and viruses. Now then! Currently, our efforts have been concentrated on the Jurassic Frontier, and we're shorthanded. There's lots still left to explore, so that's where you'll be going, deputy. Pen in hand and sword too, perhaps. Uh, do you see that large white building at the base of the mountain? Ah, that's exactly where we need to go. That's the hunter's hub. Nice. We could probably go online as well. Let's go ahead and get our paperwork from the chief there. Now, we run with this button. Yeah, that's so strange. Uh, world map. Boop. Oh, that's not the right button. Oh, God. While playing multiplier, you can enter messages in chat. Well, that's cool. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, oh, nice. I guess, you know what? Let's go ahead and create a hub and see what happens. Sure, why not? See if we can play online with some peoples. Nice. It's just me for now. Hello there, gorgeous. Look how many times do I have to tell you? You rushing me isn't going to get thought any faster. Eh? Oh, you must be the new hunter the chief was talking about. Sorry to snap at you. I thought you were another researcher bugging me for test result analysis again. Ugh. Let's start over. I'll give you the official spiel, even. Welcome to the Wicademy. The Wicademy is the preeminent authority in the study of monsters that inhabit this land we live in. The Wicademy Village Center here is sponsored by the Hunters Guild. You hunters types normally call it a gathering hall, but it's not exactly inside or even a hall now, is it? Please refer to it as the gathering hub. Anyway, now that the formalities are out of the way, let's get you registered. There we go. Nice. We are now registered as a glorious hunter. Let's go ahead and talk to the guild manager. <clears throat> What's over there? I've arranged for you to have access to it, so be sure to look before heading into a quest. Oh, okay. Yes. Let's see our new Meowskular chef, shall we? Look at him! Oh, he's amazing! That's the Gormu chef. He's majestic! Anyways, what's over here? Hey, it's a Palico! We need to get ours. Oh, congratulations on becoming a registered hunter. Sorry, I have to do my serious voice. Welcome to the Academy branch of the Hunter's Guild. As a representative of the Guild, it is my duty to manage the quest counter and uphold the principles of the Academy. Whew! I was official enough for you. So, many formalities. Totally unnecessary if you ask me. Anyway, whenever you go on a quest, just come and see me. Oh! I have to whip out my serious voice again. Oh my god. Alright, so, let's go ahead and get through this. I want to hunt our first monster. I also don't want to use the sword and shield again. Oh my god, there's so many things. Ah! Okay, so, uh, let's see here. Low rank. 
We have special permanent and hunt of the day quests. Nice. Rewarded a plus great Macau. Uh, let's see here. So we have all sorts of magnificent quests here. Oh my god, look at all these things. Now I believe the main ones... Well, maybe not. Interesting. So, we need to figure out where to get our Palico. Now, if memory serves, there is like a... Is it over here? Whoops. Travel to prep area. Nope, that's not it. I think it's in the other town. Ah, yes. Look at them llamas. Look at all them Palicos. Woo! And that's who we need to talk to to get our first Palico. What's cool is you can actually get multiple ones in this game. They all can specialize in different things, which is particularly cool. And you can even play as Palicos as well. So let's go ahead and talk to this fine young lady. What's this? A new face! Oh, I can shout! Hello, I'm the Meowstress, the Palico Scout. Scouts like me search the land for a wide... Uh, wow, for fe felines. Yeah, anyways. So we want to get our first palico. Uh, and once you have chosen your palico horde, you can manage them all on the palico board. That is also good to know. And can we get our first one? There we go. So let's see here. Ooh, Maylinx, Striped, Monotone, Two-Tone. I want uh, a tabby. Yeah, give me a tabby. Uh, you can also... Oh, you can even change the eyes. Like, look for... Sp oh, yeah. I want an evil tabby. Um, I think that's all I care about. All right, so let's see here. So I have to come back and eventually... Oh, we got a specific one. So this one has health 100, melee 65, range 64, defense 1, enthusiasm 3, charisma, uh, balanced, and standby. Nice. Rename the Palico. Oh, man, what are we going to name this one? Is it going to be... Is this... We can't name it Harley. That's, that's Monster Hunter World. We need to go... We'll go with Quinn now. There we go. That's a good idea. Oh, no. Ah! Yes, I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Quinn. It's per... Oh, wait, what What happened? <laughs> Everything's a disaster. Nailed it. All right, so let's go ahead and equip our Palico now. None of this is particularly useful. Oh, ah, ah. Come here, Palico board. Let's see here. Um, select Palicos. Palico 1. Quinn. Now we can also search for more. So I think I'm going to go ahead and set up another search. We've got our glorious Palico Quinn and our first quest to hunt 10 Macau. Just regular Macau. Uh, so we have gone out into the wilderness. Oh, hello. Like Stegosaurus thing. So majestic. So I'm really excited about this game. I hope you all enjoy it. I don't know if it's going to be as popular on the channel as World, but there are so many monsters to murderize in this game. We're going to have so much to do. This is like at least 10 times the size of Monster Hunter World. Oh, hello. What are you things? I'm gonna murder you just because I don't know what you are, and I want to find out. All right. Oh god. What kind of sweet, sweet materials do you give me? Raw meat? Anything else? Look at Quinn go over there. Now, the name of the game early is always harvest as much stuff as possible, so that's definitely what we're gonna focus on. I got an herb? Oh, there's like a Kelby over here. What are you doing, little Kelby? That's a poor thing. Okay, so you need a net for that. Or Oh my goodness. This, I forgot, you actually have to like craft the nets and the pickaxes and all that stuff as well. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of that. But um, I'm just gonna do a little bit of gathering and then we're gonna find these great Macau. There they are. The Macau. There is... I, I know I said Great Macau earlier, but we're just killing these things. Nothing crazy about it. Oh, oh I gotta hit it first, though. Oh, boy. All right, how do I target you? 
I've noticed because I, I I played a little bit while I was at E3 and I had a little bit of troubles actually targeting things. Which button is it? ZL? What does that even mean? I don't even know. Oh! <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. It's great. I probably should have trained a little bit with the weapons, but I figured dual blades would be pretty easy to start off with in this. But I'm just going to hit the sky or just random things, I guess. Now, we've also got hunter art, so I've got absolute evasion, which can come in handy. And I thought I equipped something else. But now that I think of it, that was for the sword and shield. Die! Got him. Oh, nope, that's not the button to put stuff away. Woo, it's going to be difficult going back and forth from world to this. I'm going to have permanent issues with the controls. Huh. So, slowly figuring out the controls. When I'm uh, just using Archdemon mode, I can do the little spinny attack that I really like to use to reposition. Now, in Demon mode, I don't think I can use... Oh, there we go. So, it's like... Part of the combo. Interesting. So I do that, and then I can do the spinny attack. Nice. I think we've got, like, two more of these little things to murderize. Oh, they disappear so quick. It's really hard to keep track of harvesting things. Oh, yeah! We did it! <laughs> we killed ten of these little things, so I figured out pretty much the majority of the controls for this, which isn't too bad. I'll see what rewards we get. I don't think we'll really be able to craft anything until we actually take down the Great Macau. So there's a lot of these little side quests that we got to get through before we can take on any of the big boys. Uh, but all in all, not too bad. We don't have like a timer or a countdown timer for the end of the quest. Uh, but it will take us home here in a minute. Uh, so some of the, you know, the quality of life things from World aren't going to be in this game. But regardless, this is still... A magnificently amazing monster hunter. All right, so for our items, we got uh, so we got Macau hide, Macau hide, some nitro shroom sap plant, and speed jelly. Oh yeah. So this is quite possibly the strangest thing ever. I accepted a quest to get Kelby horn, but to get Kelby horn, you don't kill them. Just just watch this. Just wait. Just wait a second. You don't kill- you stun them, and then you carve their body. Now wait for it. So we just got a warm pelt, then the thing gets up and runs away. So we just took its pelt, it gets up and then leaves. Like everything is A-OK. -okay. I took a liver from one, and he just was like, okay, I'm gone. I'll see you later. It's like, okay, you don't have a liver, so have fun with that. Little confused, but regardless, <laughs> I need two more Kelby horns. One more Kelby Horn. Oh my god, this little llama doesn't have eyes. <gasps> this poor thing. It's blind. Wait, did none of them have eyes? <sighs> they must just be covered by the fur. Okay. Well, but we finally did all the optional quests. And we finally have an urgent quest to take down a great Macau. Super excited. Finally, it took a ridiculously long time to get here. Uh, let's see here. Urgent. There we go. Vaulting Outlaw. Hunt a great Macau. And we can also slay five as a subquest for more Zenny, which is nice. Um, what I think I'm going to do, though, is technically we should probably unlock more... Yeah, well, we'll, we'll unlock more weapons after this. Do I really want to upgrade right now? Um, let's see here. Can I upgrade this? So we could level it up. That's which is interesting. Let's see. No, we can't. Um, so we can level up the Petrified Daggers. Which is better than what we got. So let's go ahead and just do that. And we need ore. There we go. Nailed it. Oh, 1300 Zenny. Wow. Okay. But that's going to be a hell of a lot better than what we had before. So life is going to be much, much better now. Now let's go ahead and hunt this thing. Now if I was a great Macau... Where would I be? Makao? I don't know. Makao sounds better. <laughs> I think it's in Area 6. Now we actually have to use paintballs to track monsters for when they run away. So I want to make sure to shoot it in the face with one of these bad boys when we do find it. 
Right, so we got regular Macau over there. I actually don't want to like waste my sharpness. I also brought traps. Uh, and I need more thunderbugs, so if I find more little flappy, flappy bugs of awesomeness, hopefully I'll get some more thunderbugs. I think, I, yeah, I did bring bug nets. Oh my goodness. So much more to do in this game. Um, alright, so there's nothing over here, but I am going to go ahead and harvest this butterfly, yeah? Hopefully we'll get some thunderbugs so I can make more traps. There we go. Nailed it. So I can make one more trap. And... My bug net broke. Oh, it's a tragedy! Alright, so we did not get any more. Let's see here. Would Are they up here? Maybe? What's up here? Come on, Great Macau. Where are you at, bruh? You're not here. Hmm. Maybe over here. Oh, snap! We found it! Ha-ha! Time to take this bad boy down! I don't have any flash pods, so we're just gonna have to, to roll with it. Now, this is actually one that I did on um, the demo. Also did some of the other ones as well. Ah! <laughs> the group I was playing with at E3, we barely were able- Oh my god! My health! Where did it go? Come back here. This darn thing. You need to be trapped, big boy. I missed! Oh, almost got me. So I do find it a lot harder to not use the targeting function in this game than I do on, say, Monster Hunter World. Oh my god, wrong buttons. Come on. One day I'll be used to the darn Nintendo Switch. I don't know if it'll be today. Maybe like a month from now. Come back here. I think I'm just gonna... Oh, my Quinn is down. Oh, poor Quinn. What did Quinn ever do to you, huh? Huh? Why are you being such an ass to my poor Palico? Oh my god, I'm dead. Ah! No. No. <laughs> there we go. At least I made some mega potions this time. First time I fought this guy I was just using regular potions way back in the day. I've got absolute evasion and bloodwind is almost ready. All the stamina. There we go. Let's try some bloodwind out here once it's not being all squirrely. Ah! Quit it with your stupid tail! Nice. Oh, look at all that damage. Oh. Oh, something hurt. This is rough. This is far harder than the Jagras. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> I was looking at my character instead of the Great Macau. Alright, so let's uh, maybe... Well, I feel like... Yeah, screw it. Let's go ahead and use a trap. Uh-oh. Errors have been made. Subquest complete somehow. Didn't even mean to do it. All right, come on, bud. Into the trap you go. Ow, jeez, it's gonna kill me just trying to lure it into the trap! Ugh. Can't hit the stupid things. Oh, it ran away! No, my trap! Oh, no! Can I pick it up? I know that's... Oh, that's so sad. Man... I missed with my paintballs twice, so I can't track it, even if I wanted to. Get 
get back here. Oh, it's tired. Now's the chance. Move. Completely wasted a knockdown. Bad tag. Now I gotta figure out exactly how to tell uh, when I'm hitting a weak spot. I think maybe. I can't tell. Maybe it's the, that blood marker. I'll have to hit a different spot and see if that shows up every time. Quit it! Just jump already! Oh, you were just. Just having a good old time, weren't you? You should go back to the other area and run into my trap. Alright, so it does show up regardless of where you hit it. Hmm. There must be something that I'm missing to tell when I'm hitting, like, a vulnerable spot, maybe? Oh, it's almost dead. Get back here. I didn't say you could leave. Now! Come to Daddy Tag. Where'd you run off to? Get into my trap. Yes, it's gonna happen. Come on. It's right here. You know you want to. Oh. What a tease. Oh, what? <laughs> it was hiding right on the edge of the zone. I hate that. Oh my goodness. What an epic disaster. How ca I can't fight you right there. Come back here. GG. Okay, good. My trap is still there. I was like, imagine... Oh, it's not even here anymore. Now where'd it go? I think it went back to its its sleepy spot. Which is maybe down here. If I remember correctly. Jump. Ah, it's back! I was gonna say, oh, look at it sleeping, and then it got up. I think it probably regens some health. If I wouldn't, if I'm not mistaken, probably. I'd imagine, at least. Let's go into... Oh no, we wasted it. Get closer. Oh god, no! gonna take a little bit to get used to the hitboxes. Oh god, he hits like a truck all of a sudden. He is a truck. It's the great Mack Truck Macau. I should probably use Absolute Evasion one of these days. Like now! Ha ha! <laughs> oh god. My body! Ah. Oh, great. Now it decreases. Wait, what's blinking? What's Rich doing? Rich, what are you doing, home skillet? Oh, we made a trap! Rich, you're a scholar and a gentleman. If only I could attack while it was in the trap. There we go. I don't have any tranks. What the hell? Use your demon powers! Okay, that was weird. We did it! <laughs> On a deflected attack, too. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. I might need to, like, enter the training area with these things and get a little bit better with them. Whew! All right. So we successfully completed our first major hunt in Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate I hope you all enjoyed it. I will be doing more live streams. I'm probably doing a lot of live streams of this just to get through the main part of the story until we unlock some of the more major stuff. Uh, so definitely keep an eye out for those. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to show your support and smash that like button. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. And I will probably show you guys the, um, the rewards before we finish up with this because i know when i was doing this last time you guys requested that so we'll see here at least we got plenty of time to gather stuff here at the end look at quinn she's like hey buddy i'm gonna help and then rich over there is always trying he's always taking a nap but he did you know come in at the end there and give us an amazing 
pitfall trap, which was awesome. I wish Palicos and World would do that. So what did we get? We got uh, Macau Scales, uh, Hide, and then... Oh, what the crap? That was weird. Sap Plant and Bitter Bugs and Maclador. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next one.